What's up guys, it's Joe the Pro here, back at it again with another video. So as you can see, um, earlier today I started removing the tables from lanes 9 through 12. And the reason I'm doing this is because I am planning on pressure washing them. So I started just doing the last four lanes just to see what it would look like because as you guys know if you have worked on the 30s tables before they are pretty nasty if you haven't ever cleaned them so that's what i'm doing here so i've already um removed most of the rods from the table it's pretty straightforward i have a small red dolly sitting under it but i'm just taking out the last few bolts right here for the top rods and as you can see i just broke the right side loose and I think I've got both sides off now. So once you have the cups and the respot cells off of the table, it is pretty light since it's cast iron. Um, there's nothing really to it. I mean, they do make a jig that you can put the table on, but I've found it just as easy to just use the dolly. As you can see, it has the rollers on the front. So it's not that hard of a task. It is a bit time consuming. It, it took me three hours total to get the four tables out of the machines. That included, you know, taking the distributors off and the curtains and the table springs, the rods. So as you can see, I have the table fully out of the machine and I'm just going to roll it up the lane here now after I change the camera angle. As you can see, I've got these nice vintage benches. There's the other three tables I removed from 10 through 12. It's honestly pretty easy to do. Here's all the respot cells and pin cups. Those are going to get washed too. 